from that kind of injury. We wish him well. And it is now 7.20, time for our first check of your local weather. Good morning, and there's some music to get you going. It is 8 a.m. in the West. Welcome back to CBS This Morning. The Shroud of Turin goes on TV for the first time in 40 years. Technology is revealing new details about the clock said to have wrapped the body of Jesus. And be careful how you drive in today's new cars. Find out how many can track your every move and maybe reveal your driving secrets. But first, here's a look at today's eye opener at eight. Gail King and Nora O'Donnell were all back together again, and that's a good thing. Prosecutors are eighth. Every baseball fan has done it, and you'll be seeing it again this week. Very nice. They say, they say a lot of people are going to be calling in sick today. They, they, they oh, yeah. be there. Yes, we'll be right back. Well, families often have to spend money to be near them. Well, Fisher House is trying to change that. In a moment, we'll talk to its chairman. But first, Manuel Bohorkas shows us why thousands of families turn to Fisher House. Miss us while you were gone. <laughs> Answer carefully. You don't want to hurt our feelings.